treatment is quite unfair to the rest of the regions. There are some regions in this republic that we don't even need to talk of because we already know. I wish my friends and families in Mount Kenya should at least travel the rest of the republic and see there are some people who had never seen water in their life at a running tap. They don't even know what tap means. Electricity, I want habari. So let's not take that direction because this is a national issue we're discussing. Okay. And we are not discussing Gashagwa as an individual. He's my deputy president. He's deputy president from any corner of this republic. So my opinion or any other person's opinion should live at that stage, not him as an individual. So on the public participation issue and the political uh, consequence it will have is that this country, we had known there are some certain trends of politics, which we definitely take regions for regions in numbers or maybe in other, considering other mm -hmm. factors. I think this is just another politics because there, there is a factor that was not at play that was just September 2022. That is Raila's story, was not at play. September 2022, when they are shown in. Now that that story had come in, I'm sure it will now bring or it will elicit different political okay. games. So maybe this could be one of, one mm -hmm. of it. Okay. But on public participation, sorry, to touch on it, I don't know the legal framework of public participation or what are uh, the threshold. What can we call public participation? But on this one, I think this is just a shroud. How can you bring a county with five or six constituencies? I don't know if you have known the difference between Moyale, that is a constituency in Marsabit, mm -hmm. and North or another constituency in Marsabit is 400 kilometers. And that's a center you want to put people from the other far end, 400 kilometers, to come to Marsabit, a center. I don't know what you mean. I don't know how the views of the rest of Kenyans, or even in the same region. Tuiru is not near. The understanding is that they're not going to count these papers it will, anyway. Let's be clear, because it's not... It's not even counting. counting. It's yes. not even counting. Even just the views itself. Okay. I think it should be captured. It should be sufficient. Okay. Uh, Gabriela, uh, the issue is uh, that uh, there, there, there are concerns that uh, the way ODM and Kenya Kwanzaa have come together in Parliament, and that combination of the vote uh, muscle, uh, that for the very first time we're now able to impeach a person as high ranking as a deputy president, that this same voting muscle could be misused or abused in parliament going forward. Do you feel the same? I don't feel the same. Mm -hmm. Because <laughs> I think uh, this is Kenya Quanta matter and they should deal it as Kenya Quanta internal matter. Uh, saying that uh, ODM, ODM, MPs voting yes. Yeah, it's their democratic right to vote yes. I have my MPs from Northern Kenya who have voted yes. But they are they usually vote yes, yes, without even reading this thing. Mm -hmm. They don't know even what they are voting. They have never even spoken in the, in parliament. So bringing ODM in this matter is just another division, politics of division. Uh, to uh, about what is going on. I think President William Ruto should change his advice because they are misleading this country. We are totally, we are speaking different from what the ground is speaking. We are focusing on issues that is not helping common monarchy. So I think it's high time, President William Ruto, to sit down, change his advice, change it in a circle and deal with issues affecting Kenya. Okay. About Mount Kenya region, uh, let not uh, say Mount Kenya, that we are speaking much about Mount Kenya. It's because uh, uh, Gashagwa has been accused of concentrating mm -hmm. with Mount Kenya. That's why all conversation is rotating around Mount Kenya. About marginalization of Mount, Mount Kenya, we have diff different areas with different issues. So they, they know why they are saying they are marginal. So as for me, I, I think everyone has their priority. Okay. And it's high time we allow other Kenyans to, to, to say what they want to say. Okay, yeah. thank you so much, Gabriela. Uh, Cynthia, your final comment on this uh, political consequences and